Hi everyone. In this task, you will be finding the largest of three numbers. The task description says write a program that takes three different numbers as inputs, three different numbers, keep that in mind, as inputs from the user and displays to the user the largest of the input numbers. So, as usual, pause the video, attempt the program. I'm sure you are going to do splendid. You're going to do a splendid job. And after three seconds, you're going to see my solution. All right, let's uh, go ahead and let's actually solve this. So we have num1, it's an integer input. We know the drill, enter first number. Only three numbers, so I'm going to say second number, and I'm going to say third number. Let's change this to num2 and num3. Perfect. Now, we, first off, we're going to check uh, if num1 is the largest number. So if num1 is greater than num2, uh, and so a logical operator here, uh, num1 is greater than num3, then it means that num1 is the largest, right? So I'm going to create a variable and I'm going to say num largest, largest, and I'm going to set it to num1. Let's say elif. Elif, let's grab this part, let's copy it here. Now we are going to check if num2 is greater than num1 and num2 is greater than num3, then num largest is going to be equal to num2. Now, if both of these cases, they are false, we know for sure that num3 is the largest. So num largest is going to be num3. Again, there are many ways of solving this. Uh, as long as you end up with the same uh, logic with the same result, there is no problem the way that you solve this. In fact, I encourage you to come up with different ways, with better ways of finding the solution. Now, this is going to uh, this is going to work perfectly fine. I just need to click here and here. So I'm just going to say I'm just going to provide some space here. Now I need to check for uh, I need to check if the user has inputted or the user has input different numbers. If all three numbers are the same, I'm just going to basically tell the user that uh, these numbers are the same. So if num largest is equal to num one, and uh, let's just say num one, and num largest is equal to num two and num largest is equal to num3. It means that all three numbers, they're the same. So in that case, I'm just gonna say print, and I'm gonna tell the user the input numbers are the same. And I'm gonna ask the user to please enter different numbers. I'm sure you can come up with a friendlier message else it means that well the numbers they're not the same then i'm just going to print to the user the largest number is now you could use uh, formatted strings here or you could just provide a comma and you could just say num largest let's save that let's run our program we need to check it for quite a few uh different uh, uh scenarios so i'm going to say um first number is going to be 10 then 11 then 12. Uh, the largest number is 12. perfect let me remove this space from here and let's run this code again so it's going to ask for i'm going to say 11 uh, 10 and I'm, then i'm going to say 12 so again it works fine then i'm going to say 13 12 and 11 it's going to be 13. I'm going to run this code again. Let's say 100, 200, and I'm going to pass in zero here. 200 is the biggest. Let's, uh, let's actually check if all three numbers are the same. The input numbers are the same. Please enter different numbers. 
So let's enter 0, 0, 10. We can see the largest number is 10. And um, uh, I'm going to check for negative numbers as well. So minus 1, minus 5, and minus 4. So as far as minus numbers or negative numbers are concerned, the biggest is the one which is closest to 0. So minus 1 is the biggest of these. And you can see it says the largest number is minus 1. That's it for this task. See you in the next one.